Hello, welcome to a week in my life. Um, so this week I got a new package from AliExpress, a new coat. Um, it is a similar color to what I got before, but this one was more of an oversized kind of look and it had a hoodie instead. So the one that I got before had just a collar, but this one had a hoodie and it had a more casual look. Um, which is easier for me to wear at the lab so that's why I got it um, then for the new year or spring celebration I made some uh, salmon because it's um, tradition to eat fish and I simply just added salt, pepper, and lots of lemon and saffron as the secret ingredient mm. So here's like the finished lo um, product and we also make a vegetable rice with it and this is what I was wearing that day. Um, I also tried some edibles mm -hmm. but I really really hated um, the experience because I've never even got drunk in my life so this was really um, not what I want to experience i felt really sleepy the whole time um, and yeah i was told by my boyfriend that it's gonna make you want to eat a lot so we got a lot of food that, like tasty food that we would want to eat that day and yeah I, um this week i had that bug style nail um and yeah um with the special um, fish dish, um, we also eat uh, some kind of aged um, garlic that's been like sitting in vinegar for um, a couple of years. It makes the garlic very soft and tasty. So um, yeah, that makes the fish also taste very interesting. Um, and yeah. I really like that um, fish um, that we eat for New Year. It's one of my favorite things. And yeah, this is what I was wearing. Um, so you'll see me wearing that new coat throughout the video. Um, here I'm eating a bao, a fried chicken bao, which is one of my favorite things. Um, that I can find beside my workplace. Uh, I came to Uniqlo after work. They brought some bike shorts in all kind of colors. And oh, they had a really good sale for their legging pants, um, $12.90 for pants. So I bought a pair just because it's um, super cheap. And they had, um, good sale for some denim um, shirts for men so yeah they always have the sales at like weird corners in the store so I really recommend you like look around because you can find some really really good deals and usually in the end of each season they have those sales and I found this really amazing ice cream that I like it's um it has matcha and Kit Kats and it was super yummy and I've been eating that for breakfast even <laughs> because um sometimes I do eat the, um ice cream for breakfast and I'm weird um yeah <clears throat> this week I worked a lot so I didn't go shopping as much as I wanted um, but yeah uh, I really wanted to get some things done this week so that um, I would have like more free time after and uh, sometimes when I feel like because um, like right now my mom is not in the country I feel like um, I don't know, I went down to doing science more when <clears throat> I don't get um, to be with people as much. Um, 
it keeps me like sane and I love science because it's always a constant, it doesn't change and um, even if you don't like some people in your life or they're kind of um, not what you want, um, it always brings me happiness and that's why I love my job so much and uh, yeah, I'm eating some food, my break, and this one is the minus 80 freezer, so yeah, this is where they keep most of the COVID vaccines, the RNA ones, and it's really, really cold. Um, the worst thing is when you don't know where your sample is in this freezer, and you have to keep um, st staying by it and looking for something. Um, it's one of the most painful things, <laughs> and yeah, um, here I came to this dark room to um, check something, and this instrument is called um, sax, which can sometimes sound like a bad word if you say it um, quickly, um, but it stands for small angle x-ray scattering. I do this um, a lot and yeah, so I have to always be careful when I talk about it and say it slowly or don't say the acronym name because if you're not familiar with it, you might get me wrong. <laughs> and yeah, this week um, I worked a lot so I didn't sleep too much and I feel like my eyes, they became red. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna relax a little bit next week hopefully and yeah i came um to h&m after work i found these really cute pillowcases they're fall fur but um they're super soft and yeah i kind of like these just checking the home section they have these really cute um mirror they um what do you call them they have like this mirror in the bottom, so it looks really nice for placing your jewelry on it or makeup or even you can use it in the bathroom. There are like number of things you can do with them and I'm really happy I and m brought those and they have a lot of different styles for them. So um, I did buy one of them that I'm going to show in the end and... But I might go back and buy one uh, for the lipstick um, case as well. So this is uh, the exact piece that I bought that day. This was 20 Canadian dollars, I believe. And yeah, it's very simple and there are multiple ways you could use this. And they also have a lot of um, varieties for this one this one is great for like um, jewelry as well and um, but this one is like a smaller version uh, the good thing is that it has a lid so um, if you have some jewelry that might be prone to oxidization I guess the ones with the lids are um, better for that and th this one is bigger and has some compartments this one is great for necklaces bracelets <clears throat> and you can put your rings in the bottom and the other one was for lipstick so I might buy that one and um, they have these cute uh, things for putting your rings in it and yeah I really need something like that because when I take a shower I take off my rings and I need to put it somewhere um, like that then I came to the clothing section but I was mostly disappointed <laughs> I don't know why um, the clothing brands they um, put energy into making things that nobody wants to buy and look ugly um, just make less pieces that are better quality um, but this one was good um, I found some active wear that looked um, 
decent but uh yeah some things they just they're trying to like look okay but they're not perfect um it's like they kind of made them halfway oh but this one was good i believe um yeah i really like these tops that have a sweetheart neckline and then this was i guess inspired by kawaii fashion but not quite there um and this one is like the beige version of the black top that i showed so those two pieces i really like them and i do think um um i might think about them but the only problem was like the knit material was a little bit like too synthetic feeling for me um because yeah i really like things that are breathable um and yeah they had some good sales for slippers and yeah some more ugly clothes here that i don't know who would buy these ones um and some sushi socks um i really like the sushi socks but yeah i think they're um, trying to bring more asian inspired um clothing oh and i saw this cute doggy on the subway so cute Wee. so cute um yeah and this is how i finally put my jewelry on the thing that i bought from h&m so i'm really happy with this one and i might go back and buy more thank you so much for watching see you next